very disrespectful to see someone else in our uniform that we fought for, and it's, it's just extremely disrespectful to any veteran uh, of all branches of service. That was Brandon Skeggs, a former U.S. Marine who served in Afghanistan. He confronted a man he says was impersonating a military officer at an Indiana high school graduation ceremony. What were you stationed? Camp Hell. Can I tell you what was your unit? Skeggs's father recorded the exchange and posted the video to YouTube, where it has been watched more than 100,000 times in just a day. I just immediately knew. It didn't take long for me to realize that he was a fake. WRTV spoke with Skeggs and his friend William Jones, who also served in the military. They say the man's uniform helped them realize he wasn't a Marine. It's the medals right there. You can see him that they're misplaced all over the place. First of all, he has two of the same medal right there. The lack of a white belt around him, I mean, that kind of sticks out like a sore thumb. The stolen the Stolen Valor Act, first signed into law in 2006, made it illegal for anyone to lie about military service. That law was later struck down in 2012 by the Supreme Court, ruling it violated First Amendment rights. A more narrow version of the law, signed by President Obama in 2013, made it illegal for a person to falsely claim he or she received a military award with the intention of receiving money or benefits for it. Skeggs never did get an answer from the man about why he was supposedly impersonating a Marine. For Newsy, I'm Catherine Beek.